dealing with tornadoes and raining weather all the time, people didn't think it was gonna get as bad. You know, I heard my sister screaming to the top of her lungs and the wind had to come through my window and to shove me clean out the bed. Give thanks to all y'all, I mean, I mean, it means a lot because y'all didn't have to come out here and do this or help us in no type of form or fashion, but y'all did. And we want to thank everybody that took time out of their work schedule, time away from their kids, uh, the military, the police department, the city of Hattiesburg. We want to thank everybody. It's devastating. Um, I mean, Hattiesburg and Pedal, my home, these citizens, they, you know, they're, they're my people. Um, it's tough going, going around these houses, you know, you, you don't know if you're going to find someone stuck under rubble and it, it's, it's almost, you, you feel helpless, you know, it, because in a way you want to help as, as many people as you can, but it's, that's impossible. You just, we got to take it day by day, try to rebuild. It's, it's tough. I hate that it's it's my home that got hit, but I also love that I'm able to serve my community, and um, it's my community that I'm helping. You know that makes me feel feel really good about myself. We will rebuild. Um, it's going to be a long process, but you know we we got people. I'm I'm helping when I'm out of this uniform. I'm out there helping helping my my people. I've got a couple friends that lost everything. You know. I'm, got my door open for for everybody you know um, just trying to help out them up the best I can.